This is Put It Into Practice, truth from the Word of God for living life. Today on Put It Into Practice, we are considering truth from Philippians chapter 4, verses 14 through 20. In this text, Paul expresses his gratefulness for the Philippians' generous giving that helped advance the gospel. The Philippian believers knew Paul was in prison and needed support. So they collected a financial gift that Epaphroditus volunteered to take to Paul. Here's what Paul said about the gift in verse 18. I have received full payment and even more. I am amply supplied now that I have received from Epaphroditus the gift you sent. They are a fragrant offering, an acceptable sacrifice, pleasing to God. The Philippians willingly gave which made the offering a fragrant gift. Not only was it fragrant, it was also sacrificial, meaning they gave their best with pure motives. They were not trying to give less than their best. They were fully committed to advancing the gospel. It was an acceptable sacrifice that pleased God. Take time to read Malachi 1, 6-14. In this passage, it becomes abundantly clear that God is not pleased with offerings that are not sacrificial. From this, we should learn to give fragrant, sacrificial offerings that please God. So today, practice fragrant, sacrificial giving through your local church so your church can be a gospel-engaged church that can give and go in advancing the kingdom of God. Now that is an offering that God will be pleased with every time.